Okay, so now, we looked at the potential speed for an actual speed, we looked at setting up our initial and more different copy. Okay, now from here, as we go to pull our knees into our chest, our partners on the cross, we move to a position where we can hit our initial pendulum sweep. Okay, now as we go to take our partner over, if our partner manages to extract our hand and post it on the floor, it puts us in the perfect position where now from here we can go into our uh, initial triangles. Now, what's the biggest problem associated with going into, uh, into front triangles? As soon as the, my partner realizes just to have me on the trap, as we go to make a transition to an emote facing copy, my partner takes her arm and either clamps down on my hip or completely hides her hand underneath my hips. So now from here, as I go to lock a triangle, I go to create this angle, it's impossible. So a great option, okay, from here, as we hit the initial pendulum and we take our partner uh, over, as the hand comes out, we switch immediately to a hunt high okay? The benefit of being in this position is that my leg is already in the correct position. So now from here, all I need to start to look to do is to bring my leg up and over my partner's shoulder, and as soon as my leg comes up and over my partner's shoulder, I use this to push myself to a further inverted position. What allows me to get into this inverted position with it, where my right knee now points towards my partner's crotch is the ability to take my left leg over my partner's shoulder. Again, I need to control my partner's posture in some way. So from here, I turn off my partner's shoulder by using my left leg, and this brings my right calf muscle into my partner's armpit. So we're initially in here. As I pivot off my partner's shoulder, we're in this position now, where again our two feet point in the same direction. Now, as my partner goes to posture up, because of the ledge of my left leg over her head, the long end of the lever of the spine, it makes it impossible. And now from here, all that's left to do is to connect our hips to our partner's neck to the strong right leg back heel, here. Now from here, we lock up a full hump icing copy. Now as our knees come together, our heels come into our butt, we can get strong finishes with a hump icing copy versus an rotation copy. And this is a great switch that you can use Whenever your partner, actually switch inside, whenever your partner tucks the hand in, if I just go for an initial triangle, now we're in a position where we can lock up and go in for a hunt ice and coffee. Okay? So we put our partner in, again, a series of dilemmas. And from here, we're going to come to my partner's back and she moves towards me, we move to the pendulum. As we go to the pendulum, if she pulls the hand out, we can switch to either one, a mote and taco, or two, we can move to a hunt ice and taco. Where from here, instead of being under a partner's shoulder, we come over a partner's shoulder. The whole thing is to make sure that my right leg points straight and down to the ceiling, and then I get my calf muscle into my partner's armpit. I use a pivot off of my partner's shoulder with my left knee to get myself into position. Where now, as she goes to uh, raise uh, her posture, the wedge in the back of the head will make that impossible. And now from here, I give a strong back pivot with my right leg to connect my hips to my partner's neck. That when I lock up, as she goes to move around from here, it's incredibly difficult to go anywhere, and the triangle gets tight very quickly. Okay, so we come through. We hit an initial knee pull to get our partner arm across. As we go for our initial tension sweep, our partner pulls the hand out, and now from here we go after a rotation to top of the time, put the contact top of the top of the set. So our front we go over our partner's shoulder, and we use a pivot on our left knee on our partner's shoulder. We get our two legs to get pointing in the same direction, and the wedge over our partner's head. That's my right knee now from the floor of our partner's front. That's how you know you have the pressure version of your right knee. Right now, I pull, I'm going to my partner's neck, I lock everything up, and we get sharp energy with a hot back to cut. Okay, a reverse triangle. One, two, three.